I'm Jess. Come and guess with me. If you have a problem, I know who to call. The puppets will solve it, big or small. Bluter and his gang, they're waiting on your call. Is a great day, a wonderful day. I'm so excited because my old matey Slinky Pete is coming for a visit. Slinky Pete? You'll like him. He's a fine feller, but I need your help, Looter. I've ordered a special present for him. Do you think you could pick it up for me? I want it to be a surprise. Sure, Cap. I can do that. Aye, it's waiting at the crossroads with Cozy, but be careful. It's very precious. I'll be super careful. I promise. Thank you, matey. Just leave it on the dock so it's here when I get back with Slinky. Aye, aye, Captain Cap. Count on it. Hi, Bluter. Hey, look what came for Captain Cap. Uh-oh. That's way too big for my scooter. Hmm. I'm going to need help. Huh, wonder what's inside. Oh, maybe, maybe it's a boat or a folding flagpole. <laughs> I caught a fish, I caught a fish. Me too. It's like magic. Nope, not magic, it's a magnet. And when a magnet comes near something metal, like these fish, it sticks, see? Fascinating. But how come it doesn't stick to me? <laughs> You're not made of metal, Patty. Magnets only stick to certain kinds of metal. Hey, Poppets, I need help. Cap wants a great big chest delivered, but it won't fit on my scooter. Sounds like fun. Let's do it! Whoa, what a big trunk. It's big enough to hold an elephant. Elephants don't need trunks, Bobby. They have their own. Oh, <laughs> elephants and trunks. I get it. That's really funny. Maybe it's a pirate's chest with gold and jewels inside. Cap said it was precious. Don't know about precious, but it sure is heavy, see? Oh, solid iron. Too heavy to carry. And we can't tow it because it doesn't have wheels. Maybe I can lift it in the pata pata. Popperific plan, Patty. I have everything we need in the clubhouse. Oh, I know. There's a rainbow in here. How would you get a rainbow inside a chest? Don't know. You, you maybe you, you 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 could fold it or roll it up or squeeze it in there. I, maybe it's not a rainbow. Patty, can you tie the other end of this rope to the pata pata? Keep oh, coming! Look it on! Look it on! Uh, I almost got it! Oh, I got it! Okay, Patty, we're ready! I guess I better get down. Careful, Patty. I promised Cap I'd take good care of it. Yay! Patty did it! Let's go. Uh, I'm coming too. I want to know what's inside. It, it, could, it could be a whole lot of toys. Or tools. Or toothpaste. Nah. Lower, lower, not too fast. 
Whoa! Oh no! Uh oh! This is going to be a problem. A big problem. A really big problem. Oh, I'm so sorry. It's all my fault. I turned the pata pata too quickly. Patty, it's okay. We all make mistakes. Poor Bluter. He promised to take good care of Cap's gift and now I've dumped it in the water. You were only trying to help. It was a really tricky thing to do. But Cap said it was a precious gift and now I've gone and ruined it. We don't know it's ruined because we don't know what's inside. We need to try to get it out of the water. Let me have a go, Bluter. Stand back. Huh? Okay, here we go. Yeehaw! Huh? Huh? Well, never tried to hook an underwater chest before. You said the chest was solid iron. What we need is something that sticks to iron. You mean like this magnet? Magnets stick to certain kinds of metal. But how will we know if iron is the right kind of metal? Only one way to find out. Go fishing. I caught something. Ha <laughs> ha, yep. Iron is definitely the right kind of metal. Keep pulling, Bobby. Oh. oh, no. It was a good idea, Bobby, but magnets are just toys. This is too big a problem for a toy. Don't give up, Patty. There's always a way to solve a problem. We just have to find it. How? The way we always do. You're right, Bluter. We need more info. We need the Patty Pewter. Hey, look! Magnets aren't just toys. They're used for all sorts of things. Fascinating! See? Magnets for the fridge. And they help you open cans. Look! That's what we need. We had the right idea, but we didn't have a big enough magnet. Wait a minute. Now that I think about it... I found this in the Poppetstown dump a long time ago. I thought it might come in handy someday. Bobby, you really do have everything in that clubhouse. I'd better get to the Pata Pata. Let's hope this works. Patty did it! Yay! Ahoy, mateys! Meet my old friend, Slinky Pete! Um, oh, I know! Uh, arr, 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 arr. <laughs> ah! Thanks, Bluter! Good job! This is for you, Slinky! Hope you like it! Um... Captain Cap, something terrible happened. Your chest fell in the water, and it was all my fault! Slinky's gift fell in the water? Yes, I made a mistake. Well, Patty, you are mistaken about your mistake, because that's exactly where I wanted it. Under the water! Under, Under the, the water? water? Aye, tis a treasure chest, me mateys. Slinky loves diving for sunken treasure. Uh, uh. You mean we're going to throw the chest back in the water? Oh, this sure has been a funny day. <laughs> okay. One heave ho, two heave ho, three heave ho, heave ho! Yeah, ghost 
Slinky, go! Go get it, Slinky! Oh, he's almost there! Go diving, Slinky! Yeah, go, Slinky! Go, Slinky, go! Thank you both for helping me move Cap's chest. And thank Bobby for using the giant magnet to get it up out of the water. Good thing the chest was made of iron so the magnet would stick to it. I'm just glad you feel better about your mistake. Puppets away! Come on, Puppets. Now we're going to find out what the treasure is. Beach balls? The treasure is beach balls? We never thought of that one. Well, to Slinky Pete, a beach ball he can balance on his nose is the greatest treasure of all!